sounds like a V6 kind of like like low key. Hey guys, I don't know how I feel about this. I feel like the car had a little bit of an exhaust leak, like it always did. Like it sounds like a stock exhaust kind of, but it's not. Even though the exhaust now might not be the same, the intake sounds sounds great. Oh, man, those poles, dude. I'm telling you, they feel a little bit stronger. So basically, before we get into the PLV drive, guys, what is going on? David Productions 345 here. You guys see the title of the video? Now the PLV drive. My car is a new exhaust No, what do i mean basically so if you guys are in the car listening it's a lot quieter so the reason i did this was because number one i have an exhaust leak or i had an exhaust leak and co was leaking into the cabin so yeah i was getting headaches and a ton of them and i was like even though the car sounds better it's not good because it's really not good so my exhaust leak was actually right where the flex pipes were underneath the car about where the cabin is the fumes are just going straight up into the cabin and that was horrible it was not safe and even though the car was louder now it sounds better it sounds healthier and everything just flows better also funny enough the car feels faster i don't know if that has anything to do with that or not but i don't know this car is pulling more so without further ado guys let's stop talking let's flip the camera around and let's get this pov started this video is going to be a POV and you guys are going to hear the new exhaust note. Let me know what you guys think about it. I'm kind of indifferent about it. I kind of like it and I kind of don't. I, I liked my old exhaust note because it was loud and it sounded good. This one is more safe because there's no CO leaking into the cabin. So, but yeah guys, it still makes the, um, the sound of the air hitting the Hellcat airbox tube. So that's cool, I guess. But like, you guys can hear those cars quiet. Only sound you guys are hearing are the winter tires. I'm going to keep in mind because it's supposed to keep snowing around here even though it's hella dry out so I don't know why. I hate when it does this because when I will take them off it'll start snowing again so I'm going to just leave them on for a little bit longer and then you guys hear the downshifts are so quiet and I do not like that. You guys hear that? It sounds like, it sounds like a V6 kind of like, like low key. No! guys think I, I don't know how i feel about that like it kind of sounds cool i still like how it has that cool tube intake sound see guys the car feels faster it's like for some reason hey yeah, guys i don't know how i feel about this let me know down below in the comments if you guys like the new exhaust note or not I mean here's the thing i like the sound i miss the sound the old sound i like this sound it sounds interesting it doesn't really sound like a charger though like it sounds different like i'll put a video clip of how the exhaust leak sounded at the very end of its ride before it was diminished I was doing the flybys in one of the videos for the goodbye 2023 video that car sounded crazy it sounded like it had like a cam or something like it was sounding good but <laughs> when i started the car in the winter time like i could see the fumes just coming straight up into the cabin i'm like yeah nah i'm good on that but also i did an oil change i don't know if i mentioned that already i think last week i forgot honestly <laughs> but look at the temps temps are running pretty good <laughs> Yeah, guys, I don't know. Like, <laughs> I like I like the new note, like, it, but it's so quiet. Like, the, I like the intake sound though. Like, that's what it has going for it. But the one thing I don't like is I can't really tell anymore. Like, if I have my, my music blaring, like how the car sounds, because obviously you can't hear the downshifts like that. 
They're so quiet. What? No, dude! I feel like this is how the car sounded like when I got it, though. I don't know. I feel like the car had a little bit of an exhaust leak, like it always did. one of the good things is that I can sit in this car and make videos without passing out. <laughs> It sounds like a stock exhaust kind of, but it's not. New territory. Let's go. Smell the winter tires. <laughs> That's not good. I'm saying guys is I'm glad I installed the Hellcat airbox because it makes the induction sound better so yeah even though the exhaust note might not be the same the intake sound sounds great I'm gonna pull over in a second We're getting into the cooler area where it looks better because of the snow, so that's cool at least. Yo, that is sick. Look at that. <laughs> guys, funny enough though, this car still has a little bit of its old exhaust now. I can still hear it a little bit. Shifts are so quiet, man. I don't like it at all. Random. Listen, you can barely even hear. I have to have the windows cracked a little bit to pick that up on this camera if it even did. All right, so let's go this way. Let windows open a little bit. All right, which way are we gonna go? Let's go. I think we went straight on Bulls Road last time. Let's go this way. 
<laughs> Man, those poles, dude, I'm telling you, they feel a little bit stronger. <laughs> yeah, that was a surprise. See, sometimes when, when you want to pose, it pulls even harder than you expect it to. I just hate how I can't hear the downshifts. Oh, that's pretty. Actually, wait, that looks kind of sick. Guys, sometimes I have to open up my windows to get air into the car so it's not too hot. Because this car heats up so fast you guys see i have it on the, the defroster mode but the air blows to the windshield and then comes back this way so i never have it really on that mode unless i want to get my car to smell better so the new exhaust pieces that they welded on do not leak and crack because I don't have a problem but I hope they're gonna last a long time let's go this way the video and then we're gonna get back to you guys when I find a place to take a pic. Alrighty everybody we made it to this random area and this is a nice parking lot but that's how the car looks just needed to get a wash for some reason this cover came off so I'm probably just gonna leave it so this center can read better but yeah this car's looking pretty good guys so the winter time hella dirty got a washer this week probably tomorrow this car's a mess man I'm telling you it's so dirty but anyways let's get back to the POV just want to show you guys this beautiful area that I'm at So yeah, now let's get some exhaust revs. This is the idle sound. Kind of quiet, but it is what it is. All right, so let's get back into this drive. You guys just heard the exhaust revs. So let's get back into this regular video. Comment down below ankle if you guys have made it this far in the video. <laughs> See where my real supporters are at. I already know some of you are hella supporters because I see you guys commenting on a lot of my videos. So shout out to you guys. Don't worry, I'm still gonna be making the Q&A video. I'm just waiting for some more questions as I mentioned in my past couple of videos. So make sure to comment some questions down below. I'm gonna save them for the video, so. See, that's a downshift. Anyways, guys, hopefully you have made it this far in this video. Shout out to you if you have. Comment down below. Uh, Mopar if you have. Anyways, we're on the road to 1,000 subscribers. So make sure you like the video. Make sure you subscribe. Make sure to turn notifications on. Share this video with your friends. And without further ado, guys, I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, guys.